L. King's net worth in 2024 was likely never going to be small. The daughter of now controversial comedian and actor Rob Schneider and former model London King, she had a bit of a leg up in the entertainment industry. With her singing success, she has been able to make her own name separate from her parents. King's single X's and O's helped to push her singing career to new heights. With her success and Hollywood backstory, we are so curious about Ms. King's net worth. L. King was likely always going to have some level of fame as her father, Rob Schneider, was a cast member on Saturday Night Live at the time she was born and her mother, London King, was a model. When she was still a kid, she made her acting debut in her father's 1999 movie Deuce Bigelow, Male Gigolo. As a teenager, she started to play guitar and starred in musicals at camp. She began performing in clubs in New York when she was just 16 and using a fake ID. She signed with RCA Records not long after and released her first single, Good To Be A Man, and her first EP, The L. King EP, in 2012. Her lead single, Playing For Keeps, was chosen as the theme for VH1's Mob Wives Chicago. King began earning traction with television appearances during this time. In 2014, her single X's and O's, the lead single from her debut album Love Stuff. The song became King's first top 10 single in the U.S. and earned her two Grammy Award nominations. With the success of the song, King was on the map. L. King's net worth in 2024 is estimated $4 million, according to Celebrity Net Worth. As the daughter of a successful actor and former model, King had a leg up with some inherited wealth. However, she has added to her worth through her success as a singer-songwriter and musician. King grew up in Ohio and reportedly lived in New York City's hipster haven Bushwick, Brooklyn, neighborhood. She first lived in New York at the age of 11 when her father, Rob Schneider, was still a cast member of Saturday Night Live. In January 2023, King revealed that she moved to Nashville, Tennessee, where she focused on her country music crossover career. Now as a resident and living here, Nashville and country music unfolds more and more layers for me, she told the Associated Press. Her transition into the country genre began in 2016 with her Dirks Bentley duet, Different for Girls. The track was nominated for Best Best Country Group Slash Duo Performance at the Grammy and won a CMA award. King gained some unwanted notoriety after her Dolly Parton tribute performance at the Grand Ole Opry in January 2024. Upon forgetting the lyrics to Parton's song Marry Me, she told the audience, via Billboard, I don't know the lyrics to these things in this F. King town. Don't tell Dolly, cuz it's her birthday. She also told the crowd, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna F. Kin lie. Y'all bought tickets for this S. T? You ain't getting your money back. I'll tell you one thing more. Hi, my name is L. King and I'm F. King Hammered. Arguably, L. King's biggest hit is the song that put her on the map, X's and O's. The song reached number 10 on the Billboard Top 100 in 2015 and spent 38 weeks on the chart. She was nominated for Best Rock Song and Best Rock Performance for the tune. Her second biggest hit would be Drunk and I Don't Wanna Go Home, featuring Miranda Lambert from 2021. The song peaked at number 37 on the Billboard Top 100 and spent 30 weeks on the chart. It was a hit on the country charts, landing at number one and being nominated for the Best Country Group Slash Duo Performance Grammy. King discussed the success of the song ahead of the Grammys in 2016. The life of this song has just been insane because we released it a few months before the album came out. Mind you, I'd never released an album before, and I didn't know how anything was supposed to go. I thought that my album was supposed to come out the same year I got signed, and that didn't happen, she added. I have just been on the grind, and touring the whole time. So we released the song, and we kept touring and we played all over. It was almost a full year, and it started to get traction last summer. Then I went on tour in the UK, and my mom was like, Baby, I think you're in for a surprise when you come home. It has been estimated that L. King makes as much as over $500,000 a year. 
However, this number should vary depending on the amount of projects she undertakes at any given time, as well as their success and whether she is touring.